All right, what's up, people, man? I want to talk about the other information coming out the situation with the lady who was beheaded out in San Mateo by her child's father and what she was exposing about this fucking fruitcake-ass wannabe gangster dude. This dude play off as some gangster, but he a jailhouse soap dropper, a peanut butter hunter, that she was about to expose the fact that he up there fucking with dudes, this nigga punk. And then the fact that she was saying he was convicted of rape of a minor and she's going to tell his friends. But then it's like, damn, did you find that shit out late? This is where the mistake comes from her life being taken by exposing this punk motherfucker who she should have never been dealing with. Did you know this before the kids came or before you involve yourself? Or was this found out later? Shouldn't have been back and forth with him. Should have just cut that shit off and unfortunately lose her life. But listen to this shit. In the day before the murder, Snapchat messages between the couple got very contentious. I obtained more than a dozen, most with language too explicit to show here. She threatens to tell the world about his rape conviction involving a minor. Rafa calls her snitch lip and warns her, F around and find out. Karina fires back. You want to put a target on my back? Your homie's going to know the real you and threatens to expose his sexual relationship with another man. She adds, dude, go ahead and try and take me out. But yeah, man, just listening to this, man, the overall situation is one in which young ladies have to learn from and who you deal with. Identify when these motherfuckers punch a lot of girls who fucking know when they dealing with dudes who be on some fruitcake shit. It's a lot of women that question that shit of whether or not. And a lot of these dudes act like fucking homosexuals. So a women be knowing who the fuck they dealing with. And then you bring a child in the world with a punk motherfucker like this. And ultimately, this old punk motherfucker to hide his uh, uh, skeletons would do that shit to this girl. And he'd do it so he end up in a place where he wants to be around a bunch of fucking dudes. I mean, go figure. This motherfucker, full out homo, playing off like some goddamn thug. RIP to this young lady. Condolences to her family. But watch the decisions you make and who you fucking lay with. That's all I got. Peace.